to Boba Fett Bricks here and today we will be um doing a uh, mock tips. Okay, yeah, let's get into it. So the first mock tip is to first of all have a nice organized space because you would need this. This would be very handy so you don't have to be like all going in big boxes, bulk boxes. And this is very useful because see if I go to my bulk boxes it'll be pretty hard to find you know proper stuff like look how much this is in here it's gonna be hard to find individual pieces like, like these or something or even like just these uh the reason i have these are empty is because i've ordered more of this stuff i've got one by ones as well so coming as well okay so um so you see this is really messy so if you try to look for this, I don't think you'll find any pieces, like good ones. Um, so yeah, that's the first tip. The second tip, oh, sorry. The second tip is to go with like, not that many colors, like say maximum four, four colors to use in the mark. Not including, you know, vehicles and characters, but I mean like, the actual parts, like say what on the mark you want to do a dark green. Uh, for the landscape, you wanted like two colors, and then that's what I do. So I choose a couple colors, sometimes even three. That's what I did for my Mandalorian one. Um, so because I used all my green colors, but you want to take like some different, maybe like some of this, uh, some olive green, maybe. Um, whatever you have a lot of, you should use because it's a good it's a good tip because you would never want to be using so many. Like, say if you were building a mark out of like rainbow colored, for example. So this is not rainbow, but imagine basically um like um these bricks with these ones. That's big difference, you wouldn't want that. Um, and yeah, and also, sorry about that. Um, yeah, there's noise in the background. And also you would like to, most like things you want to keep, um, basically in my, in my sorting system, I usually put the, uh, from like battle packs, some battle packs, I put the whole like parts in it cause I won't even build it. Thing, but this is useful because they have a lot of good parts so if you need a part you put this out this is good so yeah um so say say the battle packs are coming in with the figures there's no point building that really they're like mini builds but i what i do it's a good way of doing stuff for everything there um also is to have a variety of types of pieces and you don't want to just have like you know let's say this you don't want to have all oh, this and say this and this that's all you're going to have for your landscape you want some oh oh uh, you probably want some you probably want something like uh where is it like uh, some pieces for the rock work and it to make it more varied because it gets a bit boring from time to time when you have like two things in the landscape um, you want to keep your colors you want to be in mind of your colors um well like piece part pieces the types and you want to um yeah so those are the two things so yeah hope you enjoyed this video it's not going to be that long I'm probably gonna cut it a bit. Might not really. I don't. I, I sometimes I leave it raw. I I'm gonna try and put some more editing in every video, but for now it's not gonna be that much like the usual videos. Cause I'm not a master at editing, so thank you for watching, and bye.